This is your 3-minute radiation fallout forecast for the weekend of March 30, 2012. In Canada, the CRWS jet stream analysis shows it will straddle the U.S.-Canadian border through the weekend. Scattered precipitation will occur across the southern half of all provinces, but the areas of highest concern be Lower Alberta, Saskatchewan, and Southern Ontario, including Toronto. Sunday, the concern is shared for the Winnipeg area. In the U.S., Moderate rain and snow is forecasted across the Pacific Northwest into Idaho and Montana, as well as the Midwest and southern coastal states. Jet stream and water vapor coincides with all of these areas, and all precipitation should be avoided. In Europe, extensive precipitation is forecasted for Europe over the next 48 hours. Jet stream overlay and water vapor analysis will coincide with the following countries on Saturday, Ireland, the UK, Scandinavia, Germany, Poland, Lithuania, Belarus, the Czech Republic, Slovakia, Austria, Hungary, Romania, and on Sunday this will extend further south to Moldova, the Ukraine, Bulgaria, and Italy. Nuke Report at Robinson, South Carolina, an automatic reactor trip was due to a steam generator high water level condition. The cause is under investigation. In Monticello, Minnesota, Excel Energy reported a release of polluted water and ball filters to the Mississippi River. The Minnesota Pollution Control Agency has been informed. In Callaway, Missouri, a degraded condition was discovered in containment cooler units. This degraded equipment would adversely affect cooling function during an accident. In Browns Ferry, Alabama, a problem was discovered that could cause diesel generators to fail in the event of an accident. In Oconee, South Carolina, a sewage spill of approximately 100 gallons went into the basement of the turbine buildings and was later discharged into a nearby river. At Peach Bottom, Pennsylvania, Technical Support Center ventilation system is currently out and inoperable. At Nine Mile Point in New York, there was a loss of the tone alert system. Compensatory measures will be available through a reverse 911 system. And Fitzpatrick, New York, is having the same problem. Please call your local news station to report these events if you live by any of the mentioned plants, as our exposure to Fukushima fallout and other radioactive sources will be with us our whole lives. Please share this information with friends, co-workers, neighbors, and social media. The mass awakening to the dangers of nuclear power is happening now. Please do what you can to help it along and share caring and concern for your fellow man. This message has been brought to you by Radchik and the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Stay safe.